hope you're all still awake. Late Night Mega here. And last time we found a control rod, we found a golem. And yeah, it, it was not going to be that easy. You didn't think we could do this whole thing in one episode, could you? Did you? No. Apparently the egg basket thing, bird basket, whatever it was, it, it doesn't apparently mean anything. So now we have to try and find the golem's owner and get them to tell us stuff. Oh, I need to equip my prized cheese knife. Yeah, okay. You know, another thing I thought of regarding my equipment, and specifically armor and sets of armor, maybe I learned it off camera, maybe I'll notice like a message or a pop-up coming up, like at the end of this episode, maybe not the end of this episode, I don't know. We need to go into this house. Uh, but anyways, on Zevran's equipment, I do end up noticing that there's... It's done, the, the game gives me a message saying that, like, he gets a bonus for having, like, all the matching equipment of a certain type or whatever. Oh, right. And I'm thinking, I'm wondering if that will be true of the, uh, dragon scale leather armor that we have. Light armor. Oh, by the way, there's more dark spawn in the building. You guys, don't 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 put your attention on me. Attention should be on Alistair, not me. You there? Yeah, I know I'm not really backstabbing that one. That also went well. Nice loot all around. Oh, a barrel. A barrel of monkeys or a barrel of deep mushrooms. Oh, there's another. Yep, yeah, more money. Chainmail, it's, yeah, it's going to be junk. Junk is fine, actually. I can always sell that for more money. We have plenty of space in our backpack as well for inventory. That is one thing I'm a little bit surprised about, is not running out of inventory space yet. I thought for sure we would have in the circle tower. But apparently not. Alright, let's stab this one here. And let's stab these ones back here, and then we can go to these... deal with these other ones. I don't want to fight the one that's... Oh, whatever. You guys are actually kind of weak. You there, with the bow and arrow. Oh no, we're going up here to this... Okay. And we can see that there's some people over there, and they're actually, like, casting some spells and helping us out as well. Alistair almost died. Take a nap. <laughs> He's not dead, though. So that's... good. Yeah, I think this room was, like, one of the harder battles. And there's a quick exit back to the village, apparently. I don't need to go back to the village right now. 
we got codex entries which are or books and stuff that we get to read to give us codex entries and 50 experience that's By nice the maker, we're saved You weren't sent by the ban, were you? To save us. Ban? I wasn't sent by anyone. I heard about this place from a merchant. So we could have just starved down here? The ban gave up on us? <laughs> I suppose I should be grateful that someone came at all then. Thank you. But if you weren't sent by someone, why are you here? If you don't mind me asking. Um, I'm actually looking for the owner of the golem out front. The statue outside? Why would... Oh, I think I see. You bought the control rod, didn't you? You came here looking for shale. We're adventurers. Um, I think we glitched the... Oh no, we didn't glitch the thing. He's, he's dispelling the barrier. There'll be a part of this that gets a little bit glitchy. Where he, like, repeats a line of dialogue instead of saying what's actually on the screen. I don't know what caused that. that. I, I didn't do it. nothing but trouble. My mother sold the rod years ago after it killed my father, and good riddance! Oh. Killed your father? What happened? My father's name was Wilhelm. Mage to the Isles of Redcliffe and a hero in the war against Orlais. And what did he get? One day, my mother found him outside the tower. With so many broken bones, she could barely recognize him. And Shale standing over him, just like it is now. My father deserved better than that. But if you really want to wake Shale up, well, it's yours now. Well, the rod doesn't work, though. My father's name was Wilhelm. Mage to the Isles of Redcliffe and a hero in the war against Orlais. And what did he get? I know you already saved my life, and I'm grateful. But my daughter is inside the laboratory. She was afraid and, and ran too far in before I could stop her. I don't know how she made it past my father's defenses. One of the men tried to go after her. He was killed, but you could find her, couldn't you? Oh, yes. I mean, obviously... He wasn't a main character. No We're main characters, so we won't be killed. Out. I knew about the barrier. I, I had the key for that. But the rest of it, well, we never came down here. Ever. So how do you know she's still alive? How to activate. Uh, or I want to we just used the, the control rod and the code phrase. Or did Mother give them the wrong one? Apparently the wrong one. I wouldn't be surprised. She said she never wanted to see Shale activated again. If so, I'll gladly tell you the proper phrase. Just save my little girl. I'm begging you. That sounds like a fair deal. But how do we know? You will. I want to know why this golem killed its master. My father's laboratory is just past the next area, I think. She has to be there. And we suddenly received money? Or was that from the battle? No, that was all... That all came up... Okay, whatever. We just received money. I'm not going to complain. Deathroot, Elfroot. Those are like the most common things in this game. No, I wasn't Something on your mind. trying to talk to Alistair. I can tell him he's handsome. I'm not going to do that. There is an option where you can, like, romance the characters, and if you romance them enough, um, yes. you know, there are scenes where you can have sex with them. Okay, I'm just gonna say it. I'm probably not going to focus too much on that. Or at all. There's some shades and wraiths in here. Nice amount of experience from them. Oh, hey, there's the dead guy. A book. And treasure injury kits. Awesome iced band. We can give that to someone, I guess. Because so I think there's still some people that don't have rings equipped or both ring spots equipped. Never climbed 
Oh, we just kind of walked through some other barrier. Amalia. Oh, look. Someone's come to play. You have come to play, haven't you? Ah, uh, the puzzle in this room. It's better with more people. I hate this puzzle. Who's we? Father? Oh, you can tell him I'm fine. Maybe he'll come and stay with us, too. Anyway, you should go if you're not going to play. Kitty finds you distracting. Kitty, oh, don't tell me. The cat is demon-possessed. Kitty's clever. She says you want to take me back to my father, but I'm not going. She would be lonely. You are so kind, Amalia. I would miss you dearly if you left. Oh my gosh, are you creepy. Of course she's a cat. She just talks, that's all. That's Talking is not normal. Enough, once you know how. Neither are those purple eyes. Oh, bug whistles. You're just no fun. Bug whistles. I'm going to ignore you now. Nothing you say will convince Amalia to go with you. She loves only me now. Yeah, that's going to be a problem. I am her friend, while you are just a stranger. Oh, if we have to solve this stupid puzzle in this it's one of those like tile pushing puzzles you guys have seen those puzzles oh. right and, and Did you hear that, Amalia? this one you make the fire jump like all the way admirer. through it and... that's because you're wonderful kitty i don't been like bound it to this chamber for decades cut off from all contact is there a way i can skip the maddening. puzzle so basically Please the demon is actually like skilled in here due girl. to the barrier we Let passed and can't leave father and leave this place forever Uh, I don't make no, Kitty! deals with you will demons. Not take the child from me. She shall be mine forever. Um, I thought so she's possessing her. Well, that's not what I wanted. Stupid demon cat. Boss battle time. More of these? So actually what you are supposed to do is like agree to let the cat possess her, but then like tell her you need more time or something. I looked this up online. There is a way you can actually save the girl. Though in terms of getting shale, oh, I want a kitty dead. Kill kitty. Okay, good. Now we can focus on the rest of the skeletons now that the main demon thing is dead. Um, there's so much chaos going on. But you have to solve the puzzle, and you have to, like, actually listen to the demon a bit and agree to help it. And we get... Ooh. Helm of Hamlina, Hel Hamiloth. I can't fully read the word while I'm on the thing. But plus two to each attribute. That is awesome. And that's going to end up going on Alistair. Oh, Corpse Gall. I do need those for one of the side quests as well. But I think I need to collect 18 of them before turning that in. Oh, there's another one. Cool. I think we're going to get a lot of those at Redcliffe, and it doesn't seem like there's anything else in this room, so now it's time to head back. But heading back, we run into Shade. <laughs> Fifty Shades of Pity. There's only one of these things. Alistair, where are you? Aren't you supposed to be engaging the enemy? What happened to your stamina? Oh, wait, there it is. Okay, whatever. Oh, did we not... The Dust Wraith? Did we not get this before? Oh, look at this. Plus two strength, plus two dexterity, plus two attack... Restriction warrior or rogues, that's gonna go on Alistair as well. Because why not? And if we give him that plus two strength, he will actually have enough to equip the uh, Templar armor. Oh, that was quick. So I guess we have to go tell this guy his daughter's dead because she got possessed by a demon and we had to fight the demon. What happened to her? 
Is she in there? Why hasn't she come back? Why I didn't find it? I'm not going to lie to this guy. Dead. I don't have a reason to. Oh, my poor butterfly. Plus, I, Thank you for if you finding do her, that, at least, at least from a logical grateful. standpoint. The phrase to activate shale is Doolin Han. If you still want that bloody thing, I wouldn't if I were you. Now, I guess. Okay, well, well we're, we're going to have it. Go. I don't know why he insists on giving us this. Giving us the past. We also, he gave us money for telling us telling him his daughter's dead and kind of being responsible for that anyways uh, there is a quick exit here which is entirely for you know this purpose so yeah there is a way you can save the girl and I think you still fight kitty and you still get the stuff from fighting her but you know what we I, if I don't have to do that puzzle, and I don't think the events here are really going to be meaningful to the rest of the game, because this is DLC content, we're activating the golem. Hey, it activated. I knew that the day would come when someone would find the control rod. And not even a mage this time. Probably stumbled across the rod by accident, I suppose. Typical. Not really accident. It was a DLC. Uh, hi there. I stood here in this spot and watched the wretched little villagers scurry around me for, oh, I have no idea how long. Many, many years. He sounds a little and grumpy. the villagers had no idea they were being watched. Creepy. Then one wonders that you wouldn't be grateful to the one who allowed you to stretch your legs, Gollum. Hmm. Another mage, I see. Charming. <sighs> I was just beginning to get used to the quiet, too. Tell me, are all the villagers dead? Not all of them. Some got away, then. How unfortunate. Uh, what do you have against the villagers? Familiarity breeds contempt, as they say, and after 30 years as a captive audience, I was as familiar with these villagers as one could possibly be. Not that I wish their fate on them, no. But it did make for a delightful change of pace. Perhaps okay. I may have forgotten after all the years of being called Gollum. Gollum, fetch me that chair. Do be a good Gollum and squash that insipid bandit. And let's not forget, Gollum, pick me up. I tire of walking. It does have the control rod, doesn't it? I am awake, so it must. I do. I see the control rod, yet I feel... Go on, order me to do something. Um... There's walk over there, uh, find attack Alistair. <laughs> hey! And, uh, uh, nothing. I feel nothing. I feel no compulsion to carry out its command. I suppose this means the rod is broken? Huh, that's interesting. So if the rod Don't is broken, how come he was well, frozen in place? Mind killing the birds, those evil birds and their foul droppings. I could crush them all. Hmm. I suppose if I can't be commanded, this means I have free will. Yes. It is simply what should I do? I have no. I guess they kind of just wrote the story so they could so long. make him into no like purpose. a real character and not I just a mindless slave. A bit of a loss. What about it? It must have awoken me for some reason, no? What did it intend to do with me? Recruit you. May I ask what sorts of things it gets up to for which I could be so potentially useful? Why not just tell him? I'm a Grey Warden. To the dark dark spawn. Spawn, the very creatures that destroyed this village. Darkspawn are an evil that must be destroyed, it's true. 
They're not as evil as the birds. <laughs> Damnable feathered fiends. Wow, you I really don't like I the birds. I mean, he was I standing outside as a statue. Probably had where? birds landing on him I and pooping on him. I do not even know what lies beyond this village. For, what, 30 years? Well... Do you keep calling me it? Did I? What about your former master? I remember that I had a former master. The mage with the furry brows who poked and prodded and barked orders. Did I kill him? I hope I did kill him. Perhaps the last order he barked was, Gollum, stop crushing my head. Ah! So, were you not being controlled by the control rod when you killed him? Like, what gave yes, you the free will to I'm do just that? funny that way. Oh, whatever. Are you certain you want to bring that thing with us? It could be dangerous and large. With the group that we have, this golem will fit right Good in. Good point. Better it than me, anyhow. I will follow it about then, for now. I am called Shale, by the way. I'm Zagana. This should be interesting. And we can have Shale. He is a warrior, and he actually has like a massive amount of. Oh, who's dis Alistair disapproved? Oh, I'll smack him later. Um, maybe it's because I told the Golem to attack him. I don't know. Uh, I mean, we we get we did the persuasion check. Shouldn't that like negate the down? friendship whatever anyway so shale shale is interesting he's kind of like the dog in the sense that he doesn't wear like normal armor and carry weapons and stuff so those flawed crystals we've been getting those go to shale uh he has one weapon and one armor slot kind of like the dog he has a massive amount of hp I think I check his HP and it's like 305. And for the record, Alistair is floating like just below 200 right now. So, yeah. Uh, he's a warrior class. And he has like his own unique uh, skills and talents that you can give him. He learns like a few of the basic warrior skill trees, which is like two lines of stuff. And then he has just shale stuff, and there's like four rows of shale stuff. Anyways, before we go, let's go back to our party. Camp party. So I'll organize some things here. Uh, and before we go setting off for Red Cliff, we are going to take a pit stop at understand. Denerim again to turn in a couple quests. I am a woman. It's Sten, so he normally you likes like just warrior. the straightforward, so simple answers. That, you can't be a woman. that doesn't make any sense. Women are priests, artisans, shopkeepers, or farmers. They don't fight. Well, I'm fighting. Maybe that's true in your tribe or. Why would women ever wish to be men? That makes no sense. We're not wishing to be men. We're women that fight. Do they also wish to live on the moon? That's as attainable. Uh, I'm a woman and I'm fighting. You're following me. Like, One of what? those things can't be true. A person is born, Gunari or human or elven or dwarf. He doesn't choose that. The size of his hands, whether he is clever or foolish, the land he comes from, the color of his hair, these are beyond his control. We do not choose. We simply are. I can choose to fight. Can they? We'll see. And he slightly disapproved of that. Oh, whatever, Sten. Alright, well, with that... I don't think I'm going to do any other character conversations. With that, I will see you guys next time.